Hey guys, how are you doing? If you are just like me, maybe you just bought your new Amaz Fit Beep and you want to edit your watch face or maybe create, create a new one from scratch just to give a personal touch to your device or maybe you just want to translate uh, to your language. So it's not a difficult process, the difficult part is to actually gather all the information across the internet but I've done that for you and uh, it's going to be very simple and very easy. So let's find out how to edit and create a new watch face for your brand new Amaz Fit Beep. things that we have to do the first one is that you have to head to this website you will find any and all the links in the description and you have basically uh, to download this file and once you have downloaded it uh, you have to extract all the contents of the file into a new folder so let's create a, a random folder okay so the second thing that you have to do is to actually have and actually download a watch face, a custom watch face. Um, you can visit this website, which is amazfitwatchfaces.com, uh, which is a collector of all the watch faces. So let's say that you see a watch face that you like. Let's take mine, for example, because I know that everything is working. Um, you can download the watch face and you can see that you will download that dot bin file, all the files for the uh, Amazfit watch faces are basically .bin extensions. Once you download the file, you just drag and drop it over the folder where we extracted it, uh, all the files. Um, you will find many files, including my watch face. Um, what you are going to do is to drag and drop over the watch face.exe, the bin file, the watch face that you want to edit you will see a log of file. Basically what this program does is that it extracts all the information the, from the watch face. So let's say, let's start with the basic editing. Um, something you must know and understand is that all the information on the home screen of your Mamad's Fit Beep are basically images. So these are hours, these are, I don't know, the temperature numbers, these are the days of the week, and this is the wallpaper, okay? So uh, the basic uh, thing uh, you can do is actually edit any file. Uh, so for just for the sake of the demonstration, we are going to, uh, I don't know, draw, um, draw or move something uh, in the background. So um, I don't know, let's do something stupid like this, okay? Um, then we are going to save the, um, the file and override it, okay? So you can use any program, you can use Photoshop, you can use uh, the GIMP, you just need to edit the watch face, the PNG image. So let's say that you want to translate the, the days of the week to your language, you just need to edit these images, okay? So once you are happy with the changes that you have done to the images, um, and we are just talking about minor fixes, okay? Maybe you just want to align the heart or you just want to cancel, um, I don't know, um, uh, the lines, the white lines, I don't know. Uh, what you must do to recreate the bin is that you have to take the JSON file and you must put it over the exe file and then this is the opposite process, okay? Once this is done, you uh, can directly skip to how to um, install the new watch face or maybe you can see um, uh, an interesting way to edit the watch face too. So uh, let's say that instead you want to remove something from the watch face. You don't want, uh, let's say that you don't want uh, the kilometers to be shown on the watch face. How do we do this? Uh, basically, there are two ways. The first one is, is for the most skilled people. Uh, you have to edit the JSON file. Once you edit the JSON file, you will see that there are all the parameters. So in here, you can see activity, steps, calories, pulse, distance, and so on. Um, but I do not recommend this because it 
it takes some trial and errors to do this. What you can do is that on the same Amad Suite watchface.com, you just click on create new. And then on this interface, you have to select all the images of your newly edited watch face. So basically you just select everything, okay? All the PNG images, and then you select the JSON file that I just opened here, okay? And what happens is pure magic. So basically now on this web editor, you can see the a preview of the watch face. So why would you do this? So this gives you control uh, to the JSON file, it gives you an user interface to edit the JSON file. So on in here, you can quickly move items, okay? So let's say that I wanted to switch the date uh, with the days and with the temperature, I can quickly do this, okay? You just have to play correctly with the coordinates and in order to align everything. But if you want to go a bit deeper, you can click on edit and you will find the same JSON file that I opened here. But the coolest things is that here you can change and this here, these are some of the requests that I um, so more frequently on the Facebook groups to toggle the 12 or 24 hours, toggle seconds. Um, please keep in mind that once you toggle items, they will show here, okay? So let's say that you wanted to remove the kilometers, you just have to click on toggle distance um, and it will disappear. Um, let's say that you want to remove the distance and you want to put the, um, oops, you want to put, oh, this is a bit, <laughs> you want to put the, the, the steps a bit uh, higher. So you just go here and you have to edit manually, you know, the top left epsilon. So it's the opposite. You go like this. Uh, and you try to put the correct number. So let's say that you are happy now and uh, let's see how once you have uh, the watch face, how can you export it? So basically once you're ready uh, to go, you just click on export JSON, okay? You take the JSON, you put it back, you overwrite and you do the same thing as before. You take the JSON file here, you put it over the watchface.exe file, okay? You just wait some seconds and you will find your bin file. So I will switch now views and uh, I will record straight from the app that we're going to use. What you must do is to actually put this file in your phone. So what I do is actually I use, use push bullet, which is a cool add-on. Uh, just take the um, the file from here, you know the this file and underscore packed. You just click here, and now I have st it straight on my phone. So let's see now how to install uh, the watch face on your. Uh... Okay, so now we have sent our bean. Uh, watch face to our phone so you can see here that I sent it over push bullet but you can easily sync your phone with uh, your computer what you're going to do is to download this app which is called notify and fitness for a mad fit um, once you do it you will open it and it will take some time to sync the app with your Amaz Fit Beep, okay? Once you are certain that the application is connected to the Amaz Fit Beep, okay? You will have to go to the last page, which is going to be in English utility or tools. And here you will find custom watch face, okay? You just have to click here, you um, it will load the Amazfit watch face web website, but you have to press back. Once you press back, you see here a menu which says custom watch face. What you're going to do is to click on that and select the watch face that you see I've just sent to the phone. You click on it, you click on start, and you will see that the watch fit 
the Mads fit beep will actually um, load and reload. Oops. And if you look at the watch fit beep right here, let's put some light. I hope you can find, you can see that now it's different uh, from the one that there was before. Okay. So um, right now, if you want to choose to change the watch faces and maybe go back to one of the original ones, just, just have the regular ones. Oh God. Here in the settings, you have watch faces and you have all the old watch faces plus oops <laughs> here we go at the end you will find your new custom watch face okay there it is so basically we're just editing the last watch face available and so now you have your own custom watch face so that's it obviously it's not uh, complicated it's a bit long but um i mean it's quite satisfying to have your custom watch face on your custom device thank you for watching